You know, I've been a life member of Safari Club International for a long time. And, and the reason for that is because they're really the only organization that's laser focused on your rights as hunters. And, and I think what they've done in Africa is something very smart. They, they said, look, you guys in the West and in, in London, Paris and, and New York and Washington can talk all you want about African wildlife conservation. But if you don't let the Africans in on, on that conversation, you don't give them a seat at the conservation table, what we're doing in the West is irrelevant. So I, I think Safari Club was very smart to engage these African nations and say, look, these are your... These are your critters. This is your habitat, your country, your people. You deserve and have every right to be in the conservation table. We will bring you in, even if these other groups will not. And I think at the end of the day, there is no future for African wildlife conservation if the Africans aren't involved.